Okay, so here is the National Weather Service. Heavy snow in the western mountains with strong winds and very warm temperature. See, this is uh, 46 degrees Fahrenheit, humidity not available. Wind speed 14 miles an hour barometer. Windshield 4 degrees. Last updated March 5th, 3 p.m. So, it's funny, it doesn't say anything about humidity, but it's been crazy. We've seen spots of sunlight, hail, rain, clear, windy. It's actually sort of a west wind, northwest wind coming off the coast right now. And so it's been very crazy weather to say the least. And here we have the script. And I'd say it looks like low tide, wouldn't you? We've got a little bit of hail coming down right now. And clear blue skies, of course, beyond the hail. Okay, so this is the the new bike path, whatever jog path they have built along the bay here. And of course they did nothing to reinforce the the shoreline, but they spent tons of money on this new path. And of course, evicted all the forcefully evicted, may I might add, all the uh, homeless people that were living in these bushes. As a matter of fact, I remember the Coast Guard, the Coast Guard circled the, the homeless camp here as they burned the remnants of what the homeless people did not take when they were forcefully removed. There was a huge plume of, like that pile right there, basically. There was a huge plume of smog, fog, air pollution that loomed over the city for at least a day while they burned a huge pile of the of the, the rem, remnants from the homeless camps that were along the bay here. And this is generally considered a sort of uh, conserv conservation area. And we can see the water is, is this is actually low tide. We have water up here behind which could undermine this path as well. And, and you can see water right here, which could very, very easily undermine the path. <clears throat> and like I said, they did no uh, reinforcement of the banks. And I believe this is low tide. So let's take a little ride along here. And it's been raining off and on the last few days. It's what I might call a dry rain. Now there's there's water right there. And that's the water is actually higher than the mall. So the mall is lower than that water pooling there at low tide. 
I don't know if it's exactly 100% uh, low tide, but it's right around there. Yeah. So here we have basically this water pooling at low tide. No reinforcement of the bank. There is actually some rock right there. Apparently there was no uh, shrub, whatever, brush to put here. And so yeah, we've got water. Uh, the water line is actually above the mall. The mall is right there. If it wasn't for these railroad tracks and the small berm right here, we'd have water in that mall. Okay, so here it is 20 minutes later and we've got there's the water line, there's Walmart. This water line from what I know it's probably around low tide. This water line is probably three three feet from flooding Sears and Walmart. 